here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Hi everyone, so we just wanted to pop in just really quickly or whatnot just to give a small explanation as to what you are about to watch. So this video that you're about to watch is actually from the same day that we filmed our 25 week bump date. As you know, if you follow me, I had a lot of issues with my computer and there were just other videos that just kind of had to come out first prior to this video. But I did want to make sure that I put out this video because we did the video about flocking the tree, but we didn't show you guys what the tree looks like. So so I just wanted to pop in really quickly and give that kind of disclaimer. So if it looks like I'm wearing the same clothes, it's because I am. Yeah, I just wanted to kind of jump in and say that and uh, show you guys how our Christmas tree turned out. So thank you guys for watching. Let's jump right into the video. Let's see it. Alright. As he comes very slowly. <laughs> Hi! So we are getting ready to decorate the Christmas tree finally. In another video we filmed actually kind of flocking our Christmas tree where we make it look like it was freshly snowed on. So now we gotta pretty much shake it off, you know what I'm saying, get it together and bring it in the house. So it's probably gonna be kind of messy. David said he wanna um. I'm gonna try to do it all in one piece without taking it apart. I'm excited because we are going to decorate. Yes. But we don't got our Christmas gear on. It's coming. So we got the tree. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know how you're going to take it apart on one piece, but when we shake it, you can't completely like shake, shake. You just got to like tap dust off. You know what I'm saying? So how you want to do this? Like you just said, just got to tap dust. All right, well, you staring at it. You don't want to take it I in. I the whole thing. What you mean? You the one said you're doing the whole thing. I didn't say I was doing all the shaking. I said I was bringing it in the house. Yeah, I can't. T well, I'm supposed to shake the whole tree. <sighs> let's say, let's take out the top piece. One's gonna have, you're gonna have to keep one. I gotta take the base in first. So can you take the let's base in the second half? I can't take the base in the second half at the same time. Okay. I'm gonna try to do it all in one piece without taking it apart. All right, well, take the two pieces off. I mean, now you have to take it completely apart. It's only three pieces. Whatever you can dust off of this, just tap it, like pick up, set down, tap it. He didn't even tap it, he just picked it up. Alright, well, if half that stuff get on that flow, don't get mad at me. So we finally brought it in the house and it looks pretty good. You can tell we actually missed some spots as far as snowing on the top one. But overall it looks very good. I am very dusty. The worst of it was because we was just trying to actually put the lights together. But this is the only thing that got on the floor, which is really not a lot. All right, time to see what decorations we got. So when it comes to decorating, right, I'm very into the rustic farmhouse. So some of the stuff we got last year was stuff like this. I got some holiday mats need to put those up then we got some of these birds at sears so i'm trying to see everything i got child so that i can be able to put it up but look at these birds close up ain't that cute got it for like a dollar got some of this my favorite stuff oh we got like a good amount of that look at this this is our Christmas box that David bought. He's so organized. So excited. But we actually got two of these things. You want to start wrapping it? I'm going to need your help. I'm gonna have to... Oh, okay. Hold on. Got to put you on the tripod. All right. My butt out. Mm -hmm. This is where we got so far. It's coming together. So, David decided to move the tree. Yeah. 
He said, I'll take all the blame. I want to do something different. Yeah, so we put it in this corner right here, which is more so out of the way. I kind of dig it, though, because it ain't really showing nothing. I had to put my soft box out, child. But, yeah, I actually like it in this corner. It's kind of a little homey, kind of a little different, you know what I'm saying? So, all right, back to decorating. So this is the skirt. Gonna put this on next. We got the skirt last year mm -hmm. from, I think we got it from Kirkland's. Yeah, I love that skirt. It's so furry. So like, ooh, put it around your neck. You might be styling out here. You might be flossing on it. Oh, you look like, um, what you call that? <laughs> <laughs> the America. Uh, come, come. Coming to America. You did until you wrapped it completely around your neck. Oh, no, sorry. Like you got to do that one arm thing like, she's a queen to be. Nah, like a yeah like king mm -hmm. yes yes yeah. yeah i just need to take this shirt off and get my chest on <laughs> yeah got one chest piece out all right put the skirt on Ugh. oh he getting old child Ugh. you know child we had to move a lot of crap out the way for this video but do y'all know he never heard of the baby mama mama challenge he's never heard of the baby mama dance mm -hmm. i had to show him a video the other day and he was like okay I don't know. You gonna do the baby mama challenge? Are you down for it? I don't know. Would you be down for it? Are you down for it? That's not my question. If you down for it, I gotta do it. Aw, that's a good answer, son. That's a good answer. No one told me how exhausting this is the decorated tree child. But we got all these ornaments in here, which is excited about because we got a lot of new things that we bought from Kirkland's. I'm really excited about these fur balls. I'm sad we didn't get more of them. It's like my favorite little new ornament. We got pine cones and all kind of frosty stuff. So let's see how this goes. Hopefully it goes a lot better. Hopefully. This is one of the ones that we got from Kirkland's. It was $7, but we ended up getting it for like three dollars after the sale yeah it was like 250 or something like that i love that one that is so pretty and i don't remember getting this but i'm pretty sure we got it from kirkland's i don't never take tags off of nothing i guess just one day i think i'm gonna end up taking it back And let me fix your birdie tail up here. So you kind of like just chilling a little bit. You know what I'm saying? You over here. So clearly we have finished the tree and I am super proud of it or whatnot. Mm. This is a kind of wintery theme. Gold, white, silver, and the trees flocked of course. You know, <laughs> all that, that video you saw earlier of us doing all our work. It's kind of like a, you know, natural elements as well as man-made. So natural with like pine cones and the wood and the star in the wood and all this other you know, man-made stuff thrown in it, and then you go back to natural with good little flowers and everything. Yeah, um, I didn't never think of it like that. I just thought of it off the top of my head. It <laughs> sounded good. Didn't yeah, it? it did sound good. <laughs> yeah, I agree. It has that natural effect. I naturally call it farmhouse, but it's probably not even farmhouse. It's just a little mixture of everything, but yeah, we have our favorite ornaments that I think David, which one is your favorite? Well, if you come back here, I'm gonna take it off the tree real quick for you guys. Not off the tree. Off the tree. But this ornament right here. That's your favorite? 
it's just different. You ever seen an ornament like this before, you guys? Oh, let's get it in light. The unnatural light that we have. That is a pretty one. I wonder if I can make it's something like a similar of, to that. It's like a bunch of crystals and glass put together. Yeah, it's like this little bead thing. Mm -hmm. I don't know. And confetti, maybe. Yeah. I got another favorite one, too, though. Let me put this back real quick. I'm surprised that's your favorite. We've had it for, what, two years? Yeah, probably. Here's my other one right here. You know what? That one kind of looks like a little cool planet. That's what I was going to say. You really? Know what I was saying that stuff earlier about, you know, natural stuff and then man-made. I was like, and then we got the Earth right here. Yeah, yeah that like is. The Earth that does or look, a planet. Yeah. You know what? This looks like the Earth froze over. Right? Call this Ice Age right here. Yeah. Guys. This is so nice. I think for me, my favorite, I think only because it's a little newer, is probably these flowers. It's like, this is my... What kind of flowers are those? I don't know. Like, I used to draw these type of flowers too mm -hmm. when I was young and was more artistic than I am right now. Mm -hmm. This reminds me of like the Princess Jasmine flower. Yeah. Like she had in her hand, I don't know what these called, so if you know, child, comment down below. I would have never thought to have this on a tree. Right. So I think that's the biggest part about it. It's mm -hmm. like some of this other stuff you've probably seen before, but like this is one of the things that I never thought to put on a um, tree. And if you had more money on that child, you would have probably got more. Yeah. We all can do three. So that's what we got. So, <laughs> <laughs> but we got these from Kirkland's. And you can actually just spread them out. I like I like that you could do that. I like you can move the the leaves around yeah, and stuff. Yeah, based off of what angles or whatnot. Mm -hmm. it's, really, it's just a stick or whatnot. That was so disrespectful. That did look a little disrespectful, didn't it? You pulled it out just like it wasn't nothing. <laughs> it's barely hanging in there. So it's disrespectful. I guarantee it won't move though. It's back in place. Yeah, so that is my news favorite. Next, I think my favorite is, I would have to say, dang, it's hard because I have maybe like three phrases. Mm -hmm. Y'all say that right? Favorite. Say it again. Your words kind of went together. Favorite. Favorites. 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 Oh, I can't say it. No. Favorite. Favorites. Favorites. Yeah. Got to pronounce your O's and your R's. Favorites. I, I, I pronounce my F like I write them. <laughs> Very backwards. <laughs> the next one is this one. My little, I call it my little Furby. Ooh, look at Furby up here. Oh, uh, what not. Okay. It is another styrofoam, but they did an amazing job uh, putting all this fur on there. And it has wow. like a brown under texture or whatnot. Mm -hmm. We just got that recently too. And it, it just. How soft is it? It's really soft. Really That's soft? Furby. So I don't know how they, maybe maybe they sewed that and then put the styrofoam on it and then sewed it around it. I don't know what they did. I don't know why I'm trying to figure out how people are doing this, but <laughs> it just feels like some of the stuff, I don't know. I think you just like, you buy it out of convenience, but you be like, bruh, if you think about it, I could buy it. All I care about at the end of the day is the cost, and these things was on sale, Yeah, right? so it did pretty good yeah. or whatnot, but yeah, so that is that, and that's my favorite. I don't know, because I just noticed this one too. I like this one a lot. Too. Oh yeah? What's that one? It's, it's like a, maybe like the planet dried out. I don't know. Like, <laughs> it's dried out, but it's golden. It's golden, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so beautiful, but it's so simple at the same time. Uh-huh. And that's just how I look at life and things. Like, I like stuff that is simple but beautiful. And I would probably never have thought to make something like this. It's real cool. It goes with that whole, uh, what I said earlier, kind of natural theme. Mm -hmm. I'm really excited to see what it's going to look like years to come. Because as you know, as you start having your own Christmas, mm -hmm. you start to... Uh, you know, build on it, and that's when it started looking better and better as years come. This is probably, I want to say, second year because uh, I don't think I have a picture, maybe I do, of our old tree, but our very first Christmas tree was pink, blue, green. Yeah. It was just very like. It was loud. <laughs> it was very loud. It was loud. <laughs> It was it was a cool it was a fun tree. It was very yeah. I did a good job I feel on that tree. Yeah. But I feel like it was very like suiting for that time. Mm -hmm. But this tree is very like mature. We're a little bit more grown, grown now, yeah. And stuff like that. Like if I had that tree now, it probably wouldn't like fit. You know what I'm saying? Right. 
So I feel like this is our vibe and now that we can do our house how we want to, this kind of fits it, mm -hmm. you know. Um, and this should have been the tree that I would have year round versus that green, pink, blue tree. We kept that tree up the whole year. Whole year. <laughs> I'm that type of person. And there's some people that's like that. They keep up the trees all year round and I'm the same way and whatnot. If it's decorated good, I don't mind it. Stop lying, child, because I had up this tree last year. He done took it down. He said, we is not finna have a tree <laughs> up all year round this year. We is not finna do it. I was like, dang, it go with the house. Like, why is you gonna do it like that? Yeah. But, um. One time only, one time only. You a lie, it will happen. Uh, one time only. Oh, uh, he a lie. I don't think this one's gonna stay up all year. We'll see. So that is pretty much it. That is our Christmas tree. So until next time. Till the next one. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Yeah, I like that better. Happy, Happy holidays. Ho Dang. Don't be looking at me like that now. I'm so done. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>